Hey, church family. You know, in all of my life, I never would have thought that I would have ended up on a farm and enjoy gardening, enjoy growing, albeit we are still amateurs at it, as you can see. We enjoy the land and enjoy uh, what it brings forth. You know, this garden, this garden uh, every plant, the good one and the bad ones, the bountiful ones and the slow ones, um, the rain falls on all of them, equal amounts. The sun shines on all of them, equal amounts. In Matthew, the fifth chapter, um, where Jesus was talking about loving your enemies in the middle of all that, he says that the sun uh, shines and rises on the evil and the good, and that the rain falls on both the righteous and the unrighteous. If I were to line up 10 unrighteous people in this field, and 10 righteous and 10 unrighteous people, um, it would rain on them, same amount, sun would shine on them the same amount because God is consistent that way and man's actions do not change the nature of God because in good times and in bad the righteous and unrighteous people experience births in their lives they experience deaths in their lives they experience the, the ups and the downs neither is spared the good or the bad it falls on both. That's the nature of God. He is consistent. And man's actions do not change the nature of God. God is who he is. And today in the world, as we look around, today in the church as I listen, just to be quite honest, I hear a lot of negative talk about the world today. But dear church, the world is no different than it has ever been. In fact, things have been worse in the past. All you need to do is to go into history. Just look from 1940 to 1945 and see if things were worse than they were. Now, can things get even worse? I'm sure. But things have been worse than they are right now. And we lose our perspective. Man's actions are not going to change the nature of God. He is long-suffering, not wishing that anyone would perish. And now is the chance for the church, for us, to step up. Bad things are happening to everyone, not just bad people and not just good people. But now is when the nature of the church, our mission, the worship of God, the edification of the saints, and the advancing of the kingdom, now is when we can rise up and have the most impact. So today, dear church, gain perspective, get perspective. God is willing to give that. And he's willing to give grace to us for those that have made mistakes, for those that have lost our perspective. All we need to do is right now pray. Just stop and pray. Ask for God's, God's forgiveness, and he'll grant it. And the sun will shine again. Have a great day.